Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. To repair your dishwasher or to thoroughly clean it, you will often have to disassemble the appliance. Before you attempt this, be sure to turn off the power supply first. To access the control panel or door components, remove the screws securing the inner door panel and pull the panel free. Now squeeze the tabs to release the control shield and pull it off. When the control panel repair is complete, snap the control shield into place. Replace the inner door panel. And secure it with the screws. To gain access to the internal wash components and sump, your first step is to pull out the lower dish rack. Next, unscrew the retainer and lift off the wash arm and filter guard. Remove the screws to release the pump cover and filter assembly. Pull off the jump up nozzle. Now use pliers to help remove the retainer nut securing the rinse arm assembly. Pull off the rinse arm assembly and arm support. Remove the mounting screws and pull out the discharge pump housing. Pull off the micro mesh filter. Remove the mounting screws securing the wash impeller and pull it off. Now lift off the suction plate, filter support and cutter if necessary. When the repair or cleaning is finished, replace the cutter, filter support, and suction plate. Replace the wash impeller and secure it with the mounting screw. Make sure the impeller spins freely. Reinstall the micro mesh filter. Note where the tabs on the suction plate are located and align the notches in the pump housing with those tabs. Secure the pump housing with the mounting screws. Replace the rinse arm assembly and wash arm support, making sure the bearings are in place. Secure with the nut. Replace the jump up nozzle. Reinstall the pump cover and filter assembly and secure the screws. Position the wash arm and guard onto the support and secure with the retainer. Make sure the wash arm spins freely and replace the lower dish rack. With the dishwasher fully reassembled, you can now turn the power supply back on.